guys, welcome to Lessons in the Lounge. Hey, hey, today we're going to talk about our rendition of Living the Dream. Mm -hmm. So what are we talking about exactly? We are going to talk about how to use a sustain pedal when mm -hmm. you're playing the piano. Now that is the pedal that's on the ground underneath a piano, and its purpose is to lengthen the sound of the notes you're playing so that when you're switching between chords, there's no awkward pauses in between, there's no silence, it just really gives it a flow. Mm -hmm. So I can take you over to the keyboard and show you a little example. For show. For show. And this is the sustain pedal right here. Yes. If I was playing a little bit of our song from earlier, mm -hmm. and I wasn't using the sustain pedal, it would sound something like this. And the musical term for how precise and how clean and, and knit and tight that is, is called staccato, which means it's very fast and very, uh, it all closes abrupt. and ends to, yes, abrupt. Yes. Abrupt is a very good word. <laughs> Okay, so this time I'm going to use the pedal and it's gonna sound a lot more flowy. Mm -hmm. Do you always keep your foot on the pedal or do you take it, like when do you take your foot off of the pedal? Usually you hold it while you're playing the chord. Yep. And then you hold it through until you switch chords but once you hit that next chord, you want to take your foot off and put it back on because sometimes the first chord and the second chord can clash and right. not sound too great together. And it's not very clean. Yeah. So I like to take it off and put it back on every time I change chords. Yeah. So great. that's basically what a sustain pedal is. Yeah. Awesome. We hope you guys learned a little thing or two from our lessons today and uh, join us next time. Yeah. See you guys. Take care. So as you know, my friends and I just did a really like rock and roll cover of Midnight Riders. So I kind of just wanted to explain how we achieved that vibe, that certain vibe. 